buddy. I'm Elvis. No, I'm not going to play you guys some music. I'm going to tell you, uh, you about the weather. Today at 6.30, a, a tornado will come in, maybe an EF1. Dun, dun, dun. Stay in your basement to tonight. Bring your food and and water. A fact about a tornado. A tornado can be up to 70 miles per hour. And now we turn to Starburst live at a at a EF4 tornado. Hi, I'm Starburst. No, I'm not Candy. I'm live in EF4 tornado. I'm at the Texas Pan Handle. Tornado Alley hits Oklahoma, Kansas, Nebraska, Eastern South Dakota, and Eastern Colorado. Whoa, the winds are strong here. Fact about tornadoes. About a thousand hit United States every year. They mainly hit Tornado Alley. How could you? I see you. A thousand year old partial skull found is what now Papua New Guinea represents one of the earliest examples of human remains from the Pacific Islands region and now is what additional significance. New research shows the skull may represent the first known evidence of a tsunami victim in 2004. Now we shall move on to Mr. Rhodes. Here he is. So I am now a mile away from a tsunami that will hit in an hour. We are evacuating people in New Jersey where the tsunami will hit. Here is Sydney Doyle again reporting for you live. I am Mr. Rhodes. In another area we have a camera and a tsunami is also going to hit there, that area. So we are watching for that over there. The weather for Tuesday, we have a tsunami so be careful and, and we are getting a little snow over there in New Jersey. Hi, I'm Sam Phillips and we are reporting from Lincoln School in Cedar Falls, Iowa. We are going to Landon who is in a huge blizzard. <laughs> Hi, I am Landon and I am in the middle of a huge blizzard. It is really cold outside today. <laughs> it is eight inches deep. It is so bad that kids will have to <laughs> for the next week. Also, we have lowered speed limits. Some roads are even closed. Some speed limits um, have lowered speed limits. Some roads are even closed. Some people are going to have to take the back roads tour. This blizzard has been going on for three hours, so so be careful. You you could be hurt in this swirling snow sensation called a blizzard. The winds are going close to 50 miles per hour so it could destroy buildings. If powerful enough to do a lot of damage, people could get badly injured or die. Over 100 people, over 100 people died in blizzards in Cedar Falls in the last 200 years. The blizzard, the blizzard that I am in is, is the worst blizzard happening in Iowa right now. We will go to Oliver to see the weekly forecast. It's going to be the one of the coldest weeks this year. This is blizzard is dangerous. Let's go back to Sam. Hello, I'm Ruby Wilson, and I'm Leighton Wolf. And here's the Lincoln weather. And here's Matea with the forecasting for Hurricane Roger. Hello, I'm Matea Sink with an update on Hurricane Roger in Texas. As you can see, Roger has already damaged so much of the Houston area. Now here's Purple Puppy. Hello, this is Purple Puppy here in Houston, Texas. I'm three miles away from a hurricane from Hurricane Roger. Roger is category five, 179 miles per hour, and storm surge 25. Oh no, Roger is coming. Back to Mateo. Back to Mateo with the forecasting for this week's weather. Um, I hope you're okay. 
Okay, I'm, well, Sunday 38 degrees, Tuesday 40 degrees, Wednesday 38 degrees, Thursday 30, 31 degrees, Friday 37 degrees, lastly Saturday Saturday 34 degrees. Back to Ruby and Layden with some facts about her about hurricanes. Hurricanes form by pulling water from the ocean. The wind gets stronger together and they start to spin around the center called the eye. The eye is a spot where it's calm. Then, then the next stage of the hurricane is the eye wall. The eye wall is the strongest stage of this hurricane. It is very windy. After the eye wall happens, the wind inside the storm is pretty much the power system. The wind outside the storm gets pushed across the ocean. Sometimes the wind stays at sea, but if it comes on land, it's more dangerous for people. The hurricane will start by warm water. The temperature, air pressure, and wind have to be just right to start a hurricane. The deadliest hurricane in the U.S. hurricane on record was a Category 4 storm that hit the island of Galveston, Texas on September 8, 19,000. 1900. 8,000 8, people lost their lives from the hurricane by 15 foot waves and 130 miles per hour winds. In the Atlantic, hurricane season starts June 1st, while in the Pacific, it starts May 15th. Both end on November 30th. Thank you for tuning into Lincoln Weather. Bye. Bye. That's the end of Lincoln News. Thanks for watching! Don't eat starfish. <laughs>